so um i got a few messages in facebook asking me about a few stuffs that i was using for my harley quinn cosplay and you know one message was how i made my harley quinn choker so it's actually very simple um this is leather and the letters are made out of rubber which i painted gold now uh for a quick tutorial so you just need a piece of leather that's like um well i measured my neck but if you wanted to know how long this is it's like 13 inch and then it's actually two inches wide um it's one inches wide but you need to fold um half and half of it at the back then you have to measure your neck on where you're gonna put the snaps on then for the letters you just need to get um, some rubber i picked out a rather thick type of rubber i think this is like 5 mm so it it appears a little embossed and then i painted it gold before i glued it on the leather and then that's it so you have your harlequin choker so it's very simple I've also received um, inquiries about how I made my belt, where I got the buckle. The buckle is actually Sintra board, which I cut out manually and then painted it gold. Now for the belt, uh, this is made up out of uh, vinyl leather and then I had studs, which are actually silver and I had it painted gold because Harley's um, belt is gold so it's the same process on how you make the choker it's just that it's a little longer and bigger and wider so you just need to find out how long you need your belt to be and before you actually fold the back you have to um, install the studs first so that's it like individual manually and um, I used uh, magnetic snaps so it's easier to uh, wear so that's how I made my belt I've also um, got um, questions about how I made my holster so it's it's actually custom made and I um, just found a few tutorials in YouTube and in Google on how uh, to make uh, your own gun holster it's actually just pieces of leather and then I bought this um, studs this gold uh, round studs which have um, clamps yeah and then so I marked where I want or how far apart my studs would be and then I punched a hole on the leather and then I I like um, installed the studs and then opened the snap so it won't move and then that's the time where I had to stitch the back side so you don't really uh, see the, um, the clamps on the on the studs and for the pouch so it's just a basic pouch and I actually made this functional so I can use it I can put my cell phone here or money or whatever I need to bring while I'm in costume and then for the gun holder so it's actually pretty simple you just need to trace the, the shape of your gun and then stitch the sides and then that's it and then I just added a snap so it doesn't fall off when I'm wearing it it's really simple you really need to be very creative and resourceful on you know finding how um, you're gonna make it because there are like a lot of tutorials in the internet already on how to make this stuff thank you for people who have been telling me that I did a great job in doing the Suicide Squad cosplay and I'm so happy it really turned out good so so that's it I hope I help those people that um, messaged me in Facebook and um, I hope I gave you all an idea on how to bake um, the other pieces so you can make your own Harley Quinn Suicide Squad cosplay. So until my next project, bye bye! <laughs>